Welcome to the Crimson Engine. My name is Rubidium. Today we're looking at sound mixing and how you can get the best sound of your life with a simple click of a button. I know enough about audio to know that I don't actually know that much about audio. Uh, they spend 30 minutes of the Oscars giving away different awards for sound mixing and sound editing. And every year someone like Jake Gyllenhaal has to get up in front of a billion people and explain what the difference is. They're actually gonna combine those two Oscars now, uh, which will save us not that much time. But for the record, sound editing is creating the soundscapes that you hear in the film. All those cool lion noises that have been mixed into the engine sounds of Raiders of the Lost Ark. Sound mixing is how those and the dialogue and the music are combined. In a typical spot, some poor person has to manually go through and turn down the music every time someone says anything or any time there's a sound effect. This is called ducking. If you wanna make your own films, that poor bastard is gonna be you. Now this is fine for a 30 second commercial with three lines of dialogue, but if you have a two hour feature film, that is weeks and weeks of manually adjusting sound. At this point, you're probably thinking, now that seems like a pretty simple task for a computer. Can't software analyze the music and the dialogue and just combine the two in the best way possible? Well, there is such a program and today we're gonna to check it out. It's called Alex Audio Butler. And it not only mixes the sound and dialogue and music for you, but it adds a lot of that audio dark magic compression and EQ to make voices sound better and, and make music, sound effects and dialogue combine better. How you do this is you install the plugin in Premiere and then you divide your audio by track. So you put all the dialogue on one track, the sound effects on another track and the music on another track. You add Alex Audio Butler to each tab and then to the master tab and you customize each plugin to the specific type. So you put the dialogue on the dialogue track, the sound effects on the sound effects track, and the music on the music track. Each of the track has its own unique options. Uh, dialogue has how much effects you want it, ranging from natural to the full in a world uh, trailer effect. Music has some easy volume control. So as well as the ducking we spoke about earlier, it also has levels. You can duck slightly so that the volume drops almost unnoticeably. You can duck aggressively so that the music goes down or you can pretty much cut the music when someone speaks. This is an example of unfiltered audio. This is an example of the natural compression. This is an example of the general compression. And this is an example of the maximum compression. Now, if this was a $500 plugin, like a lot of these VST things are, you'd probably be thinking that this is nice to have, but not a necessity. Alex Audio Butler is only $80. It works seamlessly with Premiere and they're about to release a Resolve version as well. It is definitely a very cool plugin that's affordable and has a lot of functionality. What I've done is set up a template with all the settings installed on the tracks. I've saved that as a Premiere project file. And then when I start a new project, I just open that up with Alex Audio Butler already installed. Click the link in the description to check out Alex Audio Butler. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time.